I'm looking forward to talking to you about New York. How many of you have already visited New York? How many of you have never visited New York? How many of you love New York? Okay. <laughs> so, uh, you have visited New York, some of you, maybe you know many things about New York. Hopefully, today, I will have some new information for you. If you have any questions, please ask. So, New York, the big apple. The big apple, that's right. New York has a few nicknames, but the most famous nickname is the big apple. Why? We don't know. <laughs> yeah, we don't know where this nickname came from. If anyone can tell me, I will give you a hug. <laughs> or I'll give you a free apple. Okay? Okay, so let's begin. So as you know, New York is the number one city in the world. Okay? Um, but why? Why is New York so famous? Why do people love New York so much? I'm going to try to share my ideas with you today. Winter, spring, summer, fall, just like Japan. But, but, the summers in New York are much hotter than Tokyo. Yes. And more humid, more muggy. I don't recommend visiting New York in summer. It's much worse than today. Much worse, right? Yes. Three degrees centigrade, C, higher, average. Yes, three degrees. And winters, really cold. Really cold. Three degrees centigrade, average, lower than Tokyo. Plus, in New York, we have lots and lots and lots of snow. Every winter, lots of snow. So, if you want to visit in winter, be careful. We cannot control the weather, right? You might have good luck, it might be beautiful, but you might have bad luck, you might have a lot of snow, what are you going to do? I don't know. What do you do in, in winter when you have a lot of snow? You stay home. You stay home. <laughs> so you'll be stuck in your hotel room. So be careful. Be careful. Spring and autumn, perfect. The population is 8.5 million. 8.5 million. That's not just in Manhattan, that's the entire five boroughs, 8.5 million. Tokyo is about 10 million, around that, right? So a little, little less than Tokyo. But in Tokyo, everyone's Japanese, right? <laughs> not in New York, not in New York. Listen to this. White people, 44%, 44%, 2 million, 2 million of them are Jewish, Jewish, you understand, Jewish, so there are many Jewish people in New York, number one in the world, number of Jewish people, okay, Latino, Latino people, that means, for example, from South America, from Puerto Rico, those kinds of places, we call them Latino. 28%. 28%. Then, black people, 25%. And Asians, 13%. So, just like up here, very, very diverse. This is typical New Yorkers, right here. Typical New Yorkers. And how many
many Japanese people, how many Japanese people live in New York? What do you think? A lot? Not so many? 25,000. Can you say that in Japanese? 25,000? Niman gosen. 25,000 people, Japanese people, live in New York. The fat guy is my cousin. It's true. His name is Kevin James. His name is Kevin James. But if you check on the internet, you will find that his real name is Kevin Niffing. He's a Hollywood actor. He's a comic actor, comedian. Okay, now, New York has so many famous places. Let's take a look at some of them, okay? Broadway. What is Broadway famous for? <laughs> Musicals. If you go to Broadway, you must see a musical. You must see a musical. Absolutely. If you can see two or three, that's even better. Okay. Central Park. Wow. What do people do in Central Park? Relaxing. Relaxing. Walking. What is this? Coney Island. Brooklyn? Brooklyn. This is in Brooklyn. This is an amusement park and famous New York City beach. New York City has how many people? 8.5 million. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> It's like Shinjuku Station in Russia, all right? But they don't mind. They love it. Why? New York is so hot. This is the main train station, kind of like old Tokyo Station. But this was built 150 years ago. Yes, 150 years ago. If you get a chance, please visit Grand Central Station. So beautiful.